Well, we've got something uh, even more exciting. Dogs dressed in costumes. If you like that, you are going to love Dogtoberfest this year. It's an event that raises awareness and funds for local dog rescue organizations, and it features the ever-popular canine costume contest. So we want to welcome Julie Strong and Stan Parrish, organizers of this event. We thank you guys so much for being here, and we have Moxie and Tate yes. here as well. Yep. Yep. Thank you for having us. Yeah, we are so excited about Dogtoberfest. We are um, we are very excited to have you. T tell us a little bit about it. I was there last year, obviously, the canine costume contest, right. big highlight. Right. But t talk to me a little bit about why it is so important and, and what you guys do for right. raising awareness for dog rescue. Well, each year we pick eight rescue groups mm -hmm. that we will support throughout the year by raising funds mm -hmm. for them. So we have eight dog local dog rescue groups that will benefit this year from all the proceeds. Mm -hmm. um, we have vendors that come out that um, we have like 65 vendors that will be coming out this year. We have lots of dogs, um, yeah. <laughs> lots and lots of yeah. dogs. Um, we have, you know, it's just a great fun event. It's a family event. Mm -hmm. It's a dog friendly event. We have the famous K KXAN costume <laughs> contest. Um, it's always a big hit. Yep. So I, I judged that last year and we'll right. be uh, judging this year as well. We right. cannot wait. Um, very creative costumes. They always have. But Stan, you know, obviously there's lots of fun out there, but, but it's important too. W what do you want people to know about this event? Well, we want people to know that you don't have to go to a breeder. If, if you want to get a like a certain breed dog, you can go to the rescue groups. Tate is a loss of frise. He's a designer dog. Mm -hmm. You can get full-blooded boxers or cocker spaniels, what, whatever breed you're looking for. Right. Or you can get the mixes. I mean, they're all just great dogs. <laughs> right now, all the rescue groups are bursting at the seams. The, the economy's bad. I don't know of any group that has less than 40 or 50 dogs in their program right now. And there's expenses with all those. So raise awareness, raise money. Right. Uh, we want people to bid on the silent auction, mm -hmm. buy t-shirts, um, go to the Neiman Marcus photo booth. There's all kinds of ways that you can participate and give back. I was going to say, there's so much that goes on. I think last year you guys had about 2,500 people uh, right. show up just and one day. And we're expecting day. way more this right. year. Um, the domain, some of the restaurants are going to have food booths mm -hmm. this year, so that will be a nice addition. Right, and then um, several vendors are actually doing in-store events. Mm -hmm. They're going to, um, Tiffany's is going to have little dog treat bags. Oh. So people can bring their dogs in and get dog treats. How fun. And then we've actually got our first domain vendor that is a pet boutique. So they're going to be out there. So tell me, if somebody wants to enter the costume contest, what do they do? They just come to the KXAN booth mm -hmm. and they enter. We encourage you to come early um, okay. because we are limiting the number of dogs that will be entering. Um, and then we will have a pet parade prior to the uh, costume the contest. contest. So right. the dogs will actually be paraded down the uh, domain and then into the staging area. It's some pretty serious competition right. out there. People right. take it very seriously. Oh, yeah. right. There's some very elaborate costumes, you know, that people make themselves. Well, you remember that from last year. Oh, I do remember <laughs> from last year. I, I, want, uh, I want people to check out their screen right now, Dogtoberfest, of course. It starts tomorrow at 10. Right. goes all the way until 4 o'clock. It's at the domain. Uh, those are just some of the highlights that you see, but there really are uh, just so many things going on. I think the dog portraits are super fun. Yeah. A lot of yeah. people enjoy that. There's usually a long line, if I remember yes. correctly. Yes. And you don't yes. have to have a dog to come out. It's it's a fun right. festival for families to come to and just spend the day. I want to thank you guys so much for oh, being thanks, here. Shannon. We really thank do you. appreciate it. Wish you all the best, Moxie Tate. <laughs> thank you guys for being here, too. We'll see you tomorrow. We will see you tomorrow, yeah. absolutely. Also, I want to remind people we're going to have a, an X the Text. We're going to be handing out our X the Text thumb bands mm -hmm. uh, out there at the domain as well. You can find those mm -hmm. at the KXAN booth. Very important campaign that we have going on here.